Back to our top story tonight, CBS 47's Justin Lum joins us live from the Newman Police Department where many have come to pay their respects. Justin. Catherine, plenty of candles, cards and flowers left here for Corporal Singh. Remember, there were only 13 sworn officers here at Newman PD, now down to 12 in this community. Definitely had so much respect for Singh. I spoke to his uncle, who says he was a beloved family man. Yeah, it looks like you got a gunshot wound to the head. Cops got the officers 97 with a gunshot wound to the head. This gut-wrenching call heard through Stanislaus County moments after investigators say this man shot Corporal Runeel Singh when the veteran officer pulled the suspect over during a traffic stop around one Wednesday morning in the small town of Newman. Singh's uncle says his nephew worked on Christmas Day plus overtime, providing for his wife and five-month-old son, his parents and brother flying back from vacation in Fiji after hearing the tragic news. They are in a very bad nightmare. Corporal Singh shared a strong bond with his canine Sam, who was in the cop car when the deadly shooting happened. He enjoyed spending time outdoors, hunting and fishing. Seeing him made me want to live more, take chances. Most of all, Singh loved his family. The oldest of two, he moved to Modesto right across the street from his parents. If a person, a man, can be a good son, a good brother, a good husband, a father, he was all of that. Not only that, he was a good son-in-law as well. Singh started his career in law enforcement as a cadet with Turlock Police before becoming a reserve for the Merced County Sheriff's Office. In 2011, he joined Newman Police. Dozens of residents stopped at headquarters to pay their respects. A tight-knit community shocked by the loss of this fallen officer, they say, was different. Just how he talked to you, how he presented himself, how he treated you the same. Family members say Singh was proud to wear the badge and proud to serve everyone he cared for. I just can't believe we lost him. We lost someone who was a leader for our family's next generation. Newman Police Chief Randy Richardson will hold a press conference here tomorrow morning at 11. Now, if you'd like to help the Singh family, we've shared the GoFundMe link to our website, yourcentralvalley.com. Live in Newman, Justin Lum, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.